The Carey Handicap Chase is next up. It's a two mile one furlong north to 140. And at the top, we've got Harlan Quest, four miles in the end of the Witch King, Joshua Sutherland, Jazz Midget, David Robertson, Fuente Duomo, Darren Thompson, Kingdom, Graham Clitterbuck, Wisecrack Hardcare, Matt Cooper, Church Gaze, Alex Cherry, and Brockton Bay for Matt Cooper again. So a field of eight. This first handicap of the day, and then away and racing. Uh, heading towards the first of 12. So this is the we're taking this one. And Jazz Midget on the inside. It's just the first issue on the top weight Island Quest. And it looks like Jazz Midget is going to get a get an uncontested lead. I think it seems all that keen to challenge him at the moment to get to the first. We jumped quite slowly and has come back to the pack just a little bit. They're heading up the straight then now for the first time. Next time around is the time that'll count. This fence will be the final fence on the next circuit. Jazz Midget leads over it from Kingdom in second, Island Quest in third, and the Witch King on the inside is fourth. Inside of that one is Brockton Bay, Fuente Duomo in the white sleeves, and the second Matt Cooper horse, Wisecrack Hardcare, and finally Alex Cherry's orange sleeves on Church Gaze. They pass the winning post there with a complete circuit of the Ascot track to go, and Jazz Midget is in the lead. David Robertson all showing the way, as it did in the last race, and quite gone for him last race. We'll be hoping for a better outcome this time. Jazz Midget is four clear. Of the Witch King in second, Brockton Bay is in third, and Kingdom, Fuente Dobo, as they get to the third. Which they will get over nicely. Racing down to the next when they get to the back part of the track, the fences come up pretty thick and fast. They get over that fourth without mishap and they head down towards the fifth. And it's Jazz Midget continuing to show the way. Holland Quest second as they get over the ditch. And at the back, Church Gaze. Jazz Midget continuing to lead into the next one. Um, Holland Quest and Fuente Domo and then the Witch King. Then come Brockton Bay and Wisecrack Hard Ken, Church Gaze and finally Kingdom. Inside the final mile now. And Jazz Midget. Trying to make every post a winning one. On Fuente Domo in second. Island Quest is third. The Witch King is fourth. Church Gaze is then getting closer. As they get to the next. One was a fall of their kingdom's gone. The Kingdom's a fall up at the back. Oh, that leader nearly went as well there. And also a bad mistake at the back. My wise track half game, but that's really not the stuff in a jazz midget who's now dropped back into fourth, but it really jumped well at that next one now to get right back into contention again. Over to third last they go. And now it's Jazz Midget back up, disputing the lead with Fuente Domo. Highland Quest the top weight is in third, just been trapped in. In fourth is the Witch King, then comes Brockton Bay, and then Church Gaze, and then finally Wise Track Hardcare as they swing for home. Then they've got two to take, and it's Jazz Midget who's gone back into the lead again from Fuente Domo in second. Island Quest and the Witch King are next, and a little bit of a gap to Brockton Bay over the second last they go, and the leaders land together. These two are clear, surely between these two. Fuente Domo has now put his head in front, and has suddenly gone three quarters of a length clear. He's got a length clear. Fuente Domo down to the final fence with a lead of about a length and a half for the long time leader. Jazz Midget back in second. They're over their final fence then now, and it's Fuente Damo who landed in the lead and he's landed clear. And with less than a furlong to go on the running, they're not going to get anywhere near. It's going to be a quick fire double for Darren Thompson as Fuente Domo takes it, leading by a good three or four lengths. They can just pull it away again. Jazz Midget second, then Witch King rocked him by Church. Gage was after that one, then Highland Quest, and finally Wise Grant Hard oh, King was the last one to finish. And Fuente Domo takes it for Darren Thompson. Two races, two wins today for Darren Thompson. Jazz Midget second for David Robertson, the Witch King. Joshua Sutherland was third. Brockton Bay, Matt Cooper fourth. And Church Gaze for Alex Cherry was fifth.